Good day guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. In my last video tutorial, I talk about how to convert text to formula in Neze. Alright, in today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hide formulas in Neze and then show values. Now, before we learn how to lock cells in Neze and hide formulas in Neze, okay, you need to understand how it works on a conceptual level all cells in the day are locked by default but it doesn't work until you also protect the cells only when you have a you have a combination of cells that are locked and protected then you can truly prevent people from making changes okay when you lock formulas in the day the you the users can make any changes to the cell within the formula okay however if that cell is selected the formula in the cells will be visible in the world in the formula by right of okay now this is not an issue in most cases but if you don't want the formula to be visible you need to hide it okay now before going into further details let me add up these figures right here by using the sum function okay equal to sum okay then open the brackets so let me add this right here so i'm going to hide it okay then close the bracket then press enter button then i can drag it or double click on this place or drag it Hold on, sorry okay now i can likewise fix here by what using the auto sum function okay i can use the also function okay right now next let's now delve into how and uh, the step to work to hide formulas in the in the law say now the first step, step is what is to work select all the cells in the worksheet so what i'm going to do is that i'm going to press my the control a for my keyboard so now go to the home tab you can see the home tab right at the far left hand side here at the top now navigate to the wall, editing group right here okay then click on word find and select okay from the drop down the select no, go to work special okay so after you must have done that then the from the go to special special dialog box from the drop down link just select the formulas right there okay okay now after you have, must have done that then click on work okay button good after you must have done that this will select all the cells that have formulas you can see it right here it selected all the cells that have formula in it okay then press ctrl 1 ctrl 1 from your keyboard you can just press ctrl 1 from your keyboard too a dialog box will pop up right here yeah, which is what well, this will open the format cell dialog box okay in the format cell dialog box go to protection tab you can see the protection tab right right here then click on well check this box that is written hiding okay after you must have done that okay click on what okay button note as i mentioned earlier a cell that has not been locked cannot be protected the same applies when you hide formulas in a cell unless the cell is locked only checking the hiding checkbox wouldn't do anything to truly hide formulas in a cell the cell should have should have the lock okay should have the lock and hiding button check which i have done that right here okay and it should be protected which i have to do that and before the form, uh, formula in the cell can be all hiding now basically we have we have locked the you have we have lock and hide the cell okay from the from this above cell let's now protect the entire worksheet so that those formulas can be locked 
and was hiding. Now, here are the steps to lock all the cells in the worksheet. So, the first step is, is that click on the just navigate to your to the top of your window right here. Click on the review tab. Okay, now once you do that in the changes group right here, okay, you can see it, you can see changes right here. Just can uh, click on protect sheet okay after you must have done that in the protect a uh, protect signal box we open let me just drag it at the side here so the protect dialog sheet will open make sure that you have checked the protect worksheet and content of log say make sure it is checked though uh, it is checked by default now enter the, the any desired password you want so to protect it so let me put the password there okay now though this is optional except you want to password the protected sheet okay now specify what a user is allowed to do by default the first two boxes here are check that allow a user to select lock and unlock cells okay you can allow other option as well such as formatting cells format columns format row insert columns insert rows insert hyperlink and so on okay and after you must have done that so you just click on what okay button so it will if you have used a password it will definitely go to ask you to reconfirm the password so let me confirm the password that i used earlier so now i cannot click on what okay good so if once you lock once lock you will notice that most of the option in the ribbon are unavailable and if someone try to change anything in the worksheet it shows a prompt a prompt as the say what or chart you are trying to change is what is what is what protected you can see the change on this is it's on the protected worksheet okay you can see the cells or chart you are trying to do is on the protected worksheet so now okay to unlock the worksheet just you can just follow the uh, the procedure we use in the previous uh, step just click on what the when the review button at right, right up here and click on word and if you have used a password to lock the worksheet it will ask you what to what to enter the password to unlock so i can then use my word password i can put in my password to unlock it so now when the user select a cell that has formulas you can see so all these cells they, they are formula embedded in them you can see that i'm clicking on it it's it has hide the formulas there in the formula by so it doesn't show the formula in the world in the formula so so as i'm clicking on the the cell it shall not be said the formulas are not showing so of if it shows that it has been well, hiding okay so i can also unprotect this worksheet by going to what unprotect worksheet then click on what and uh, putting my password okay and click on what okay but you can see that once i click on it now the formula is what well, is showing at work well at the formula bar so that is it thank you and don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel as i'll keep giving you more of the world as a function bye and stay blessed